Welcome again to the Quip Corner with me. 10 days to Christmas already. So, all your gifts bought and shipped for those who need to ship their gifts. Have you done all that Christmas shopping already? Okay, well, join me in the Quip Corner. We'll be talking about gifts getting and giving. See you in a bit. Thank you for joining me in the Quip Corner. Yes, a moment ago I was asking if you had bought all the gifts that you need and possibly shipped them. The thing about buying gifts is there's more to buying a gift than just the price of the gift. There's also the price of time. You know, if you don't time the gift buying properly, you may be spending more money than you need to, or even more time identifying the gift. Well, keeping with the word for last month, and looping in the word for this month, I'll put both videos up there so you can catch up later. Let's dive into today's quip. It's a quip from my third book, and it's quip 84, I believe. I keep saying I'll put bookmarks, and then I do sometimes, and sometimes I don't. And yes, there's a bookmark but in the wrong, on the wrong page. Okay. So that's the picture at the top. And it says, you cannot hold time back. So get on with what you need to do. Now is the time to act. You cannot hold time back. So get on with what you need to do. Now is the time to act. Earlier this month, I talked about wigs. Word inspired goals. And last month, the word of the month was time. This is my existence. Tangible influence matters everywhere or every day and, you know, many other spell outs. With 10 days to Christmas, I'm challenging myself, I'm challenging you to give yourself the gift of time to start working on your wigs. Of course, we know that another word for today or now is the present. So the present is one present we each need to unwrap and properly utilize if we want to achieve our wigs. Yes, I can't overstate that. In preparing for this, I found some really nice quotes about making the most of the time and things like that. I'll read a couple to you, okay? Let's go. This one, the author is anonymous, but the author said, tomorrow is often the busiest day of the week. A lot of times we say, oh, I'll get to it tomorrow. I'll get to it tomorrow. And tomorrow never really comes because when tomorrow comes, it is already today. Let's look at another one. Timothy Ferris said, someday is the disease that will take your dreams to the grave with you. 
I pray that doesn't happen to any of us. Someday. Yes, I'll get to it someday. I'll get to it someday. I'll finally work on that wig. I'll finally work on that goal. Mm -mm. Today is the best day to start planting the seeds of the harvest that you expect. Today is the best day to start making those plans towards the goals you want to achieve. And who knows, there are some of your goals that you may even still be able to achieve this year. Yeah. One of my favorite someday quotes is the one by Jeanette Daly, who said, someday is not a day of the week. It's as simple as that. We can't hold back time. We can only maximize the time that we have. People talk about, oh, one day. Once again, one day too. <laughs> it's not a day of the week. <laughs> Playing around with days and someday and today and so on. Israel Moore, Aivor said, someday. You said you'll do it yesterday. Yesterday, you said you'll do it today. Today, if you push it to tomorrow, it's likely tomorrow you'll shift it to someday. Do it now. Do it now. So with 10 days to Christmas, please give yourself the gift of deciding today to start working on your goals. A lot of us are good at supporting others. And with time, you look back and say, oh, wow, he, she, they were able to achieve X, Y, Z. And you wonder about yourself. And if you're not careful, it could end up with resentment. So give yourself that gift. God has blessed you with the gift of time. Don't misuse it. Use the time to work on your wigs. I look forward to reading from you on how you plan to use the gift of time. What seeds you know you need to plant. For instance, I've started asking God for guidance on how he wants this channel to operate next year and i'm giving a lot of prayer and thoughts to that that's part of my gift to myself and eventually to the world as i said before i look forward to reading your comments so let's keep interacting god bless you bye now